<laughs> I just love Chinese equipment. This phone is another example. Okay, so as I was saying, this is the DVD drive. Your roller that sucks it in is uh, right here. You know what happens with this screen here is it, it folds out. I wish I could show you. I don't have any power hooked up to it. Okay. But the problem I was having was identifying the uh, components inside. Well, actually, trying to find out who the manufacturer was. Uh, just showing you the guts here. I will post pictures that I took there a little bit better resolution. But this is pretty much it. Your GPS NAD card is right there. Uh, you know, your uh, radio input for your antenna. TV, all the other good stuff. Uh, good. Adequate, I guess. These little connectors right here, I found some of them that were, um, they're not cor correctly inserted, so I um, have to reseat these. Just a little problem, and those little Chinese kids don't seem to like to um, tighten their screws down too much, so that's another thing I'll be fixing. A note of mention here is, okay, get the light right. These two little shiny things you see are for the USB card or uh, flash drive cards. SD cards, whatever you want to call them. The one on the left hand side is for GPS, the one on the right hand side is for multimedia, etc. You know, I've already tried loading up system files on the right hand side, and that's a no go. So, this thing is somewhat back together here for you. Back side looks like this. And this mainly all, this is just for um, anybody who's bought this to identify uh, the unit they have. Hopefully it is the same one. I found about three different um, model numbers on the board on the inside on the PCB. So I'm going to use the one that has a sticker on it, and uh, eventually I'll get this thing put together to where I can go ahead and uh, update the GPS software.